Hi there, my name is Richard McMunn from the interview training company PassMyInterview.com and in this tutorial I will teach you how to pass a web developer interview. So if you have an interview coming up for a web developer role for any organisation whatsoever, make sure you stay tuned, watch the presentation fully from start to finish because I will help you to pass your interview. And to achieve that goal, this is what I will cover. I am going to give you a list of web developer interview questions that I strongly advise you prepare for. I'm going to give you brilliant, unique answers to tough web developer interview questions. I'll give you some tips on how you can stand out during your interview. And I will also tell you about further resources you can get access to, including these slides to help you pass your interview. And just very quickly, before we get going, a very warm welcome to this web developer interview training presentation. My name is Richard McMunn. That's me there in the center of the screen, the bold chap. I've been helping people for about 20 years now to pass their interviews. I always do that by giving you unique, genuine answers you can't find anywhere else. Make sure you subscribe to the channel. I am uploading insider job interview training videos every day and I don't want you to miss out. You can also connect with me on LinkedIn. I have put my LinkedIn link in the description below the video. And please hit the like button. That tells me you enjoy the content and it is therefore worthwhile me creating it for you. Let's get going. The first question that I want you to prepare for is tell me about yourself. So this is going to be the first web developer interview question that you will need to answer. So let's make sure we give the interviewer a positive top scoring answer that includes the skills, the qualities and the experience you have and what you are going to bring to their organisation as a web developer. So here's a great answer to help you. Tell me about yourself. I am a positive, enthusiastic and competent web developer who, over the years, has built up a diverse range of skills, qualities and attributes that guarantee I will perform highly in the role. I have extensive experience working both alone and as part of a team on often time-sensitive, challenging web development projects that require outstanding creative and technical capabilities and the ability to ensure all work is optimised across a wide range of platforms. Now, I take my work as a web developer seriously, and this means I always ensure my skills are kept up to date within this rapidly changing industry. If you hire me as your web developer, I assure you I will fit into your team quickly. I will always put the commercial needs of your business at the forefront of everything I do and the work I carry out will be consistently to a first class standard. That is a brilliant answer that sets you up with confidence for the rest of your web developer interview. Now, you can either pause the video if you want to and take a note of the questions and answers as we work through them together. Or if you want to wait, I will tell you soon where you can download my full set of 29 web developer interview questions and top scoring answers, including the ones we are covering together today. Here is the next question. Why do you want to work for our company as a web developer? Now, it's vital we show the interviewer that you have carried out research into their organisation and that you have valid and genuine reasons why you want to work there. Here's another great answer to help you. Why do you want to work for our company as a web developer? There are lots of web developer jobs out there, but I want one where I am going to be challenged and where the skills and qualities that I have built up are going to be put to good use. I carried out lots of research into your organisation prior to submitting my resume and the work you do, the products and services you offer and the way you support your employees tells me this is a great place to work. I am seeking long term employment with the same company where I can really immerse myself into their brand and their online ambitions. And this is genuinely the only place I want to work as a web developer. That's another really great answer to help you pass your interview. Now, don't go anywhere because I still have many more questions and answers to work through with you. But when you're ready, if you want to click that link in the top right hand corner of the video, it takes you through to my website, passmyinterview.com, and you can download my full set of 29 web developer interview questions and top scoring answers, including the ones we are working through together today. Here is the next question. How do you plan a web development project? Now, this is a common web developer interview question that is assessing your ability to manage and produce difficult web development projects in line with the client's or the organization's requirements. 
Here's a brilliant answer to help you. How do you plan a web development project? There are eight fundamental steps I use whenever I plan a web development project. The planning stage is crucial to the project's success. Step one, I will define the goals of the project and specify the objectives and the budget. What do we want to achieve and by when? Step two, I will discuss and establish the wireframe, going into detail of how the website must function, including ensuring it meets Google's best practice guidelines. Step three, I will establish the content that will be used at launch and the content strategy moving forward. Now, content is king and I would be keen to ensure the content is fresh and, more importantly, it meets the needs of the end user. Step four, I will establish the design and functionality of the website and these would be built around the wireframe and the website's content strategy. Step five, I would determine the team of people involved and who I would need to utilise to get the project complete. Now, this might include using outsourcers for specific elements of the project, including graphic design, etc. Step six, I would put everything into a definitive action plan before commencing work. Step seven would be a period of intense testing across different browsers and mobile and desktop devices to assess the website's speed and functionality before finally launching the site at step eight. That is a brilliant answer and it is very clever because you are talking about each of the different steps that you're going to use when you plan a proper web development project to bring it to a successful conclusion. And you can see there how effective it is by talking about those eight different steps. The next question, what do you like and dislike the most about being a web developer? Now, dealing with and working alongside people is an important part of being a web developer. This question is assessing which aspects you will find the hardest and how you will overcome the challenges that this role presents. Here is my answer to the question, what do you like and dislike the most about being a web developer? The aspects I will like include being able to put my wide range of skills and expertise to good use during challenging web development projects. I will enjoy working alongside other like-minded professionals who are all collaborating to build the best website possible that meets the ever-changing needs of the end user. Now, in terms of the parts I will dislike, the only thing I would find difficult perhaps is when I must deal with external outsourcers or contractors who don't have the same appetite for project completion as I do. Having said that, I have built up strong communication and interpersonal skills over the years, so I feel confident I can drive people forward and get them to complete things on time. That is a really strong answer. You will notice there that I have not mentioned about dealing with difficult clients about being a part that I would probably dislike. I don't think you should mention anything that's based around clients if you are having to deal with them as a web developer, because that is just a challenging part of the role that you would have to overcome. And if you find that bit difficult, then you might not be able to achieve your goals as a web developer. The next question, what will you bring to our company as a web developer? This question might be posed as why should we hire you? Now, this will be another guaranteed web developer interview question that you need to answer in a positive way. Make sure you give a response that is unique and that makes you stand out from the other candidates. And here's the best way to answer it. What will you bring to our company as a web developer? I will bring a fast pace of working, in-depth technical knowledge and an understanding of what is working right now within your industry from a web development perspective. I will also bring strong project management skills, team working capabilities and the understanding that professional web development is critical to your organisation's success. Finally, I will bring a positive mindset, the ability to fit into a team and an overriding passion for web development that I believe you will witness in the results that I produce for you. That's a great answer. It's short, it's positive and it's punchy and you will be the only one who uses that level of response, helping you to pass your interview. Now, the next thing to do is make sure you click that link in the top right hand corner of the video, go through to my website, passmyinterview.com. Take a look at the 29 web developer interview questions that I recommend you prepare for, for your particular interview. You also have the option to download all of the answers, including these slides. And there are also some very important tips on that page to help you succeed at your web developer interview. Make sure you read them. Thank you very much for watching. Make sure you subscribe to the channel. Connect with me on LinkedIn. My LinkedIn link is in the description below the video. And please show your support and appreciation by giving the video a like. I would very much appreciate that. Thank you very much.
Have a brilliant day and I wish you all the best for passing your web developer interview. Thank you very much.